Okay, ladies, the time has come. The moment of truth has arrived. The main event of all main events. It's butchering time. It's time for the IT hardcore band. From Santa Cruz, California, a bewilderment of talent. The one, the only, ladies, it's Drain Day. Much like title fight before them, Drain possess magical abilities. They transform all type slammers into high flying type slammers with max stats. So that's why slammers spend the whole fest grinding for XP. In hopes of unlocking the highly sought after float board ability. Oh yeah, and like it needs to be said, the world's championship is on the line. And we got 5,000 hungry slammers all vying for the opportunity to be called Pit Pro's world's champion. We won't get a lot of brawls or hype trains. Just slammers flying around like they're over top of the airspace of Area 51. Slammy Sammy. And Slammy Sammy happens to be the best frontman. Possibly of all time. His ability to hold that crowd in his hand and make them all do the craziest shit. Meteora! Takes a shit ton of talent and a whole heap load of charisma. Double dive! And you gotta know it pains me to heap all this praise onto Drain. We have history. We have personal issues. Beef dog from the top of the spiral tope! Speaking of beef, we got beef. Beef dog with a floaty stomp from the top. Rusty the musky cross punk. Floaty crossbody from the top. Drain sack. So like I was saying, Huge Tope from the top! Massive Tope Con Hilo! Oh my god, like I was saying, there's petty drama between us. And Beef Dog, our champion, reaches for a floaty like he's a painting in the Sistine Chapel! Beef Dog with a backflip from the top! But I can't let our beef cloud my judgment. Huge barrel roll from the top! on what is objectively connecting with the audience in the most visceral way. Just look at this. And this double dive featuring Grimy Greaser. Drain is in that lineage of bands that unite and simultaneously transcend the genre. Like Turnstile before them and Title Fight before that. Drain is on that list of bands. Their musicianship, their songwriting, their crowd psychology are all on point. And they might actually surpass those bands I just named. Beef Dog with a natural selection to Slammy Sammy! Cartwheel! Elbow! He has them right where he wants them. They're so good. I just wish they weren't such dickheads. But you know, I love pro wrestling. A world filled with the slimiest and the carniest scammer low lives. So it's really no big deal. But you gotta know his chill vibe is a character. Don't let yourself be so naive. He uses cool boy intimidation tactics that only strengthen his place at the top of the scene. The dude's a fancy gatekeeper type. But he can make 5,000 motherfuckers do this. From the top! And believe it or not, I happen to be pro gatekeeping. As sucky as it feels sometimes, Jesus fuck this! To be left out. Take the pillbase from the top! Gatekeeping is a necessary force. It's a naturally occurring phenomena. Suicide from the top! In many cultures and subcultures, 
You know, I'm an outsider. 2018 Logan Paul! And even I have to gatekeep. Not everything fits within the parameters that I need it to for this show. I need this kind of pandemonium. And if I don't get it, I skip it. So even though I say he's a bit of a wank, I know he can say the same thing about me. Floaty toe base plot from the top! And depending on your perspective, it's all facts. But you know who doesn't care about our petty beef? Banana hunk! Beach balls and bodies! Plancha! Dumpy sent on! Flying elbow! Front flip! Floaty suicida from the top! Missile drop kick! Rolling leg whip! Barrel roll from the top! Holy shit, he gets all of it! RFC guy's elbow drops are progressively getting more insane! I'm not here to create any new drama. I'm still just here to celebrate the very best in our culture. Like a shirtless astronaut floating through space. Or this headwalk from the top. Massive trios dive, very lucha libre. Spiral floating floater. But I still gotta talk about my story. It may be water under the bridge. Barrel roll from the top. Talked cannonball. But I burned that bridge right to the ground. So I'm just left with this grudge to hold. And it's actually more fun to hold the bigger that they get. A thing of beauty. Now it may not be the most mature thing in the world, but this is an entertainment channel, not a maturity competition channel. So in one hand, I will acknowledge how good and significant they are as a band. And in the other hand, I'll be a snarky little shit face. Corkscrew moon salt. We're all born human. Beef dog. But only a few of us become slammers. And even fewer become great. So to see all this greatness condensed to one area, I know it's cringe, but it's special. Rusty the musky cross punk from the top. In the span of two years, Drain went from being the next big thing to the current big thing. A Sammy chant breaks out amongst the slammers because he is the baby face hero amongst his home state crowd. Sammy, Sammy, Sammy. They'll sacrifice their bodies because Sammy has a cult-like grip on their free will. Oh, maybe Slammy Sammy will notice me. And then they can be on the other side of the illustrious case. And then maybe they can play collective friends. As if the common slammers were mere Pokemon. Beef dog! They all knew it was gonna be nuts. But there is no way to predict exactly how nuts. Elbows are still being enthusiastically thrown. Painful belly flop. New Metal Dreads guy. 2018 Logan Paul with a suicida. Very ironic. The fit that's fit for the pit. Floaty tope. Backsplash plancha. Oh my god, it's a frozen in time meteora from the top. Elbow. Spiral floating tope. Crushing elbow drop from the top. Double knees to the face. Trust fall. Our champ is MIA right now. And as crazy as these slams were, Beef Dogs was still number one. Tope through the pile up. The stage is littered with slammers. Bodies are being tossed around like overused sex dolls. The float board can only do so much in a situation as unhinged as this. Trainer at the top of the class. Even though they're major dickheads. 
Thanks so much for watching.